In this video, we'll be taking a look at three NBA games happening on March 12, 2024, and providing you with free team picks and total picks for each one of those games, so six picks in total. Welcome back to Cash Out Sports, let's dive right into it. Oh, and don't forget to subscribe and to click the bell icon to get notified as soon as these videos get released so that you have more time to plan out your bets as we provide these videos on a daily basis. I can guarantee that you'll have all the important information that you'll need on these three NBA games after fully watching this video. One more thing before we start, if you would like to gain access to our best exclusive sports picks to take your journey to the next level, then check out our Patreon in the link down below where we offer our best single picks, parlay picks, and much more. Now let's get started. Indiana Pacers vs. Oklahoma City Thunder The Indiana Pacers are embarking on a journey to the Paycom Center in Oklahoma City, Oklahoma, where they are set to face off against the formidable Oklahoma City Thunder. Currently boasting a season record of 36-29, the Pacers find themselves positioned at 7th place in the competitive Eastern Conference. On the other side of the court, the Oklahoma City Thunder reigns supreme in the Western Conference with an impressive record of 45-19. This encounter marks the initial meeting between these two teams in the current season, following last season's matchups where each team secured victories on their respective home turfs. In recent games, the Indiana Pacers have demonstrated commendable form by securing victories in six of their last ten matchups. Their determination is evident, highlighted by a convincing 111-97 road win against the Orlando Magic on Sunday. Notable performances from Pascal Siakam and Tyrese Halliburton, who each contributed 20 points, propelled the Pacers to success. Despite a slow start and trailing at halftime, a remarkable third-quarter surge, amassing 39 points, allowed them to overcome a 15-point deficit and secure the lead for good. Contrastingly, the Oklahoma City Thunder are riding a wave of success, triumphing in 10 of their last 12 games. They are poised for a fourth consecutive victory after a dominant 124-93 home win against the depleted Memphis Grizzlies. Shai Gilgis Alexander spearheaded the charge with 23 points and 6 assists, complemented by Casson Wallace's 22 points off the bench and Josh Giddy's double-double performance of 16 points, 10 rebounds, and 4 assists. The Thunder's impressive shooting, including a scorching 21 of 47 from beyond the arc, solidified their control from the early stages, amassing 38 points in the first quarter. Despite their recent success, the Pacers remained shorthanded with Benedict Mathurin and Doug McDermott still sidelined. In contrast, the Thunder are monitoring the status of Jalen Williams, who is questionable due to a sprained right ankle. The Thunder have excelled as favorites at home this season, boasting a record of 19-8 against the spread. Furthermore, they hold a 4-1 record against the spread in their last five home games. In their previous meeting in Oklahoma City, the Thunder emerged victorious with a final score of 126-106. Anticipating a dominant performance from the Thunder, they are poised to extend their current winning streak and maintain their home court advantage. The Pacers, with a struggling record on the road and facing an elite defensive opponent, are expected to encounter difficulties in halting the Thunder's efficiency on both ends of the court. The Thunder's well-balanced approach is likely to be the key factor in their domination of this matchup. The Indiana Pacers' inconsistency on the road, coupled with defensive challenges, diminishes the confidence in supporting them against formidable opponents. In contrast, the Oklahoma City Thunder have been a reliable bet throughout the NBA season boasting a 39-25 record against the spread. Although the Pacers enter the game with some momentum after defeating the Magic, the Thunder's consistent performance throughout the season positions them as justified favorites, especially at home where they boast a stellar 26-6 record. The betting line for this matchup is considered reasonable. An interesting statistic to note is that the Thunder and the Magic are the only teams in the NBA with cover percentages exceeding 60%. This trend has proven successful thus far. Considering the Thunder's track record in covering the spread in two of the last three meetings with the Pacers, there is a strong likelihood that this trend will persist, driven by the continuous growth and experience gained by the Thunder's youthful roster. Therefore, the Oklahoma City Thunder to win and cover the spread as favorites is our full game side pick. When analyzing the offensive and defensive averages of both teams over their last three games, the overall season, and their performance at home and away, a projected total of 235 points emerges. Factoring in the average pace of both teams at 103.4 possessions, the final projected total reaches 243 points. Given the high pace maintained by both teams, over the projected total is our full game total pick. 
Minnesota Timberwolves vs. Los Angeles Clippers. The Timberwolves are currently on a road trip, set to face the Clippers in Los Angeles on Tuesday, March 12. Holding an overall record of 44-21 this season, Minnesota stands in third place in the Western Conference. However, their recent performance has been less than stellar, having lost four out of their last six games leading up to Tuesday's matchup. On the opposing side, the Clippers, with a record of 41-22, are positioned in fourth place in the West. They, too, have won four of their last six games, creating an intriguing clash between these two competitive teams. In recent times, the Minnesota Timberwolves have experienced a slight downturn, losing four of their last six games, seeking to avoid a third consecutive defeat after a 120-109 road loss to the Lakers on Sunday. The Timberwolves faced a tough challenge. Nasri led the team with 25 points and four blocks, complemented by Anthony Edwards, who contributed 25 points, seven rebounds, and seven assists. Assists. Despite their efforts, the team struggled, shooting only 42% from the field and 16 of 46 from the three-point line. The fourth quarter proved challenging, as they managed only 17 points, allowing the Lakers to secure the victory. Conversely, the Los Angeles Clippers have maintained decent form, winning four of their last six games. However, their two-game win streak was halted by the Bucks in a 124-117 loss on Sunday. Norman Powell's 26 points off the bench and contributions from other players were not enough to withstand the Bucks' second half surge. The Clippers shot 45% from the field and 14 of 47 from the three-point line, setting the tone in the first quarter but ultimately succumbing to the Bucks' offensive onslaught. The Timberwolves face uncertainties, missing Carl Anthony Towns, with Anthony Edwards, Ruddy Gobert, and Kyle Anderson listed as questionable. The Clippers are monitoring the status of Kawhi Leonard and Paul George, both questionable for the upcoming game. Despite the Timberwolves' historical dominance in the series, when Winning six of the last eight meetings, recent setbacks raise concerns. Minnesota's two consecutive losses and a 2-8-0 record against the spread in their last 10 games add to the uncertainty. While the Clippers boast a 4-2 record in their last six games and a strong 22-9 home record, the Timberwolves face a challenging scenario with key players listed as questionable. The recent victory of the Clippers over the Timberwolves, coupled with the questionable status of key players for both teams, suggests that the Timberwolves might be at a disadvantage advantage. Opting for the Clippers, who have displayed better recent performance and depth, appears to be a more prudent choice. Therefore, the Los Angeles Clippers to win and cover the spread as favorites is our full game side pick. Recent matchups between these teams have trended towards the under, with seven of their last 10 games finishing below the total. In their previous encounter, they produced only 177 points, indicating a defensive-oriented game. Despite scoring 221 total points in their last meeting in Los Angeles, the game went under the set total. This trend extends further, as the teams have gone under in three consecutive games at the Crypto.com Arena. Examining recent performance, the Clippers have gone under in six of their last nine games, while the Timberwolves have gone under in five of their last ten. Both teams exhibit a slower pace of play, emphasizing the importance of possessions in the game. Although offensive turnovers are rare, the solid defensive rankings of both teams imply that scoring opportunities may be limited. As such, we anticipate a low-scoring NBA game making under the projected total our full game total pick. Milwaukee Bucks vs. Sacramento Kings The current season has seen the Sacramento Kings achieve a commendable 36-27 record, positioning them at the seventh spot in the highly competitive Western Conference. Despite an outstanding performance by DeMantis Sabanis, who notched an impressive 25 points, 15 rebounds, and 8 assists with a remarkable 90.9% field goal accuracy, the Kings fell short against the Houston Rockets. The game concluded with a final score of 112-104 this past Sunday. Now, they face the perennial Eastern standout, the Milwaukee Bucks, a team boasting a 42-23 record and holding the second seed in the Eastern Conference. The Bucks arrive in Sacramento with momentum, having secured victories in seven of their last nine games. As they conclude their four-game California road trip, the Bucks aim to capitalize on their recent successes, aiming to build on wins against the Clippers while facing setbacks against the Warriors and the Lakers in their initial four games. On January 14th, the Bucks secured a 
narrow victory over the Kings, prevailing with a final score of 143 to 142. This marks their final meeting for the season. The Milwaukee Bucks have been displaying exceptional form recently, winning seven of their last nine games overall. Eager to maintain their hot streak, they clinched a hard-fought 124 to 117 road win against the Clippers on Sunday. Damian Lillard led the team with 35 points and 11 assists, shooting 11 of 19 from the field. Giannis Antetokounmpo contributed 34 points, 7 rebounds, and 10 assists, while Malik Beasley added 17 points. As a team, the Bucks shot 49% from the field and 17 of 38 from the three-point line. Despite early struggles against the Clippers, they rallied with 65 points in the second half, securing the narrow win and improving their overall season record to 42-23. Conversely, the Sacramento Kings have maintained decent form, winning six of their last 10 games overall. However, they they are looking to bounce back after a 112-104 loss to the Rockets on Sunday. Demandis Sabanis led the team with an impressive performance of 25 points, 15 rebounds, and 8 assists. Malik Monk added 20 points with 5 assists off the bench, and Darren Fox contributed 18 points. Despite shooting 45% from the field, the Kings struggled from the 3-point line, making just 6 of 32 attempts. After a strong first-half performance with 59 points, their efforts went in vain in the third quarter managing only 14 points and trailing for the rest of the game. Heading into the upcoming matchup, the Bucks may be shorthanded with K.A. Tris Middleton and Marjan Bochamp both questionable. The Kings are keeping a close eye on Keegan Murray, who is questionable due to a left ankle sprain. The Bucks have struggled to cover the spread with a 28-37 against the spread record, while the Sacramento Kings have shown resilience as underdogs, boasting a solid 13-8 record against the spread in such situations. Additionally, the motivational factor plays plays a significant role in the Kings' potential success, particularly at home. Malik Monk's impassioned speech and commitment to getting the Kings back on track add an emotional element to the equation. With Monk's leadership and determination evident in his interview, there is a compelling narrative for the Kings to step up, especially in front of their home crowd. As the Western Conference playoff race tightens and every game becomes crucial, the Kings have the extra incentive to perform at their best. While the Bucks are on the back end of a California road trip and haven't been home since March 4, Thus, the Sacramento Kings to cover the spread as underdogs is our full game side pick. Milwaukee has not only won the last 10 games against Sacramento but has also seen the total going over in each of these encounters. Scoring has not been a challenge, especially in the last six games, with each contest witnessing at least 239 points scored. Five of these games even surpassed the 250-point mark. These two teams are proficient in shooting, but their defensive capabilities are relatively mediocre. Milwaukee holds a clear advantage at the free throw line and from three-point range, which played a pivotal role in their six-point victory. Therefore, over the projected total is our full game total pick. That's all for now, so if you have any other games you would like reviewed, then leave a comment down below with the game you would like analyzed, subscribe to our channel, leave a like on this video, and we'll get to it as soon as we possibly can. We would also love to hear your opinion on the picks presented to you in this video, whether you agree or disagree with them, so leave a comment down below and do let us know.